Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another one of our unboxing videos and uh, what we have today is the Milbro Supergrade XS58. Now this has made me turn to the dark side, this is a 177. Uh, the reason I've had this, I wanted to try out a 177 and I got into a conversation with a group of lads in the gun shop who says you want to try these, they're not very much but they're fantastically accurate and come with a built-in moderator and they do an offer with a scalp as well with it so it seemed a, you know, a decent offer. Got a 3 9 b 40 adjustable objective scalp with this uh, fitted in the box as you can see. I'll just take the box away for a second and I'll get in our cradle like that. There we go. Now it's uh, an optic. Uh, I'm right in saying that. Yeah, it's an optic 3 9 b 40 So it's a adjustable objective scalp that comes with it. Uh, 177. It says on the barrel that this will go up to 350 psi. I think if you take this gun up to 350 psi, uh, 3,500 psi. Sorry, I think you're going to blow it up. So when I um, blow it up I went to uh, 2000 psi and as you can see on the gauge there it's on the green. I don't know if you can pick that up on either of the cameras there and that was quite enough for me. Uh, I didn't want to push it any further. I feared if we went into the 3500 psi it could have caused the gun some damage. Now it's a Milbro. Super grade. Obviously, Milbro is a subsidiary of SMK, as we know. Um, you don't get a full probe with this gun. Once you take the end off there, full probes on the end of there, and obviously, you just slot your uh, your chosen method of filling it onto that. Uh, this is the 177 I've mentioned. It's a 12 shot tray in this, but you do only get one magazine and one single shot tray. The scope mounts on this are Picatinny. They're not dovetail rail, so obviously think about that when you're buying one of these, that it's easy Picatinny and you may have to buy mounts to obviously match that. Um, it has a safety catch, which is fitted here, just inside the trigger. Simple click forward to uh, lock and click forward again to fire. It's a beach stock. It's not very heavy. However, I've not got any stats to say it's weight. It says weight to be confirmed. So I'm taking a guess that this is about the three and a half kilogram mark on scope. So obviously like I can't wait because it was come already fitted with a scope. So it gives it an unfair weight advantage there because obviously the scope's on it but I would say unscope is going to be about three and a half kilograms. Uh, it is a nice gun and I have had a little play about with it earlier on. It's very very accurate too as uh, I was told. I have put this through a cleaning process to make sure that it's ready for its test and review which will be coming later on um, and I'm looking forward to it really. Um, I'm not sure what the shot count on this will be, but uh, obviously as I do get a chance to use it and uh, I will try and give you as much information on that as I can. Uh, two stage trigger comes with this, um, obviously as you know it's a PCP and it's, uh, it's a 12 shot. Uh, it says the tank here, and I've got the bump in front of me because I'm reading it off the computer here as we talk. It does say 200 bar max, but it says on there 3,500 3, psi, which, as I say, unless I've got my um, conversion from that's going to be dangerous. Uh, other things I can tell you, as I said, uh, all you get inside the box is one single magazine, one single shot tray, a couple of allen keys and I think the other item in there is like a pressure gauge, uh, you know the air release uh, piece. Also obviously you'll get your um, your manual in there. Hopefully there's uh, more stuff in there that uh, can help me out because at the moment that's not very good is it. It says on here 
da, 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 da. in one seven seven uh, this does eight hundred frames per second uh, eight hundred feet per second sorry so we'll have to give that a try I'll put it over the chronograph when we go through our uh, test and review see what it is pumping out um, I haven't got one, any 177 pellets in to test this but um, I was informed that these go well with Bisley Magnum so I bought a tin of Bisley Magnums just to uh, do to test and review with hopefully that they come out really well and they'll be the, uh, the pellets that I do stick with with this but uh, as I say at the moment um, that's all I have so we'll have to test with those uh, having a 177 it was obviously all new to me and uh, I'm looking forward to seeing how this goes um, I'll do as I normally do at the end of this, I'll do a full picture montage of around the gun and you know we'll add that to the video at the end so let's see how, uh, let's see how that goes now we'll put the picture montage together this has been the unboxing obviously look out uh, very shortly for the test and review video but uh, thank you all for watching and I'll, say I'll put a picture montage at the end so you can get yourself used to the gun and uh, see what it's like all the way around Thank you all for watching. Speak soon.